Alright, let's see what's gonna happen in this chapter. Uh, chap it's, the chapter's called Limit. Will there be a light at the end of the voyage? Probably not. 18 hours since departure. Awesome. Oh yeah, that's right, Kuropiko. Yeah, he fainted. Oh, thank God, I was debating whether or not I should take the risk and call a doctor. What time is it? Um, it's been 12 hours. Oh, nine. Okay, never mind. Okay, yeah. I do know that. He's been asleep for 12 hours. Nine. Fuck, what, I, what did I keep saying? 12. The others haven't noticed that you passed out yet. They think that you're uh, out on duty, so keep your voice down. How long have I been passed out? About, about nine hours. That long? Yeah, he's... It's definitely cut off a few a little bit of time from his life that's for sure and the queen actually she passed out around the same time you did Whee! hey dolphin coon ember time yep oh yeah for the past 12 hours yeah see that's what I meant where is wobble he's over here he's dead they killed him while you were asleep it appears if you run yourself too hard and break down then the person who's sharing your ability will suffer the same okay all right learning new things about Kirpika's ability cool so the emperor time has a limit of three hours of continuous continuous use and if i go over that then i black out for three times that nine hours wait it's also possible that the time limit may change depending on potency potency of the stone ability and it's still activated now the next limit Next limit might even come sooner than three hours. Before I lost consciousness, I could hear my pulse almost exploding in my ears. That was likely a signal of the impending limit. Oh, Exp his pulse almost exploding! Wow, it's a lot, Grabiga. Maybe next time you won't you won't give yourself so many restrictions. Your Highness, yes, I know I shall continue this vigilance and continue with the twelfth prince. Uh, no, pushing my ability like this was much more taxing than I'd anticipated. The deep sleep we fell into was likely due to that. Because of that, I want to change the order of the surveillance. Please start off with the fourth prince's bodyguards and their positioning. You don't look very good. Are you sure you're alright? You don't look very good either. <laughs> oh, you don't. <laughs> to be honest, I'm not sure myself, so I need you to do something for me. If I give the, if I give the signal, then no matter what you're doing, immediately give the dolphin the order to release the ability. So then we'll start with 4th Prince Sergei. Oh. oh boy, what are we gonna see? Is this, is this another one of your self-preserving tactics? Oh. No, that would carry the biggest strategic advantage for us. All of the 4th first Prince's private guards are likely Nen users. Not even the smallest bug would be able to sneak into that room. On the... Okay, yeah, yeah. On the other hand, there is no time restraint to testing out their security, so I decided it would be best to save infiltrating them for last. The fact that the second prince did respond to a call is also there. One of tribal troops, yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm hmm. Uh huh. More talking. I mean, that's to be expected from Hunter Hunter, but still. Your Highness, I truly understand your unease, so I will say it as many times as necessary. Please trust me. Trust me. Trust me. He's, he is literally the only reason she's still alive. We are here to ensure the safety of your Highness and the Prince. Please trust me. Lady Oito. Wobble. Mm hmm. Well, Wobble, trust him. How about you, Prince Wobble? Da. Da da. Oh, hold on. <laughs> There's the whale ship. Let's see what's going on. Must be careful and take care to not get lost. But if I don't hurry, then the burden on Kirpika will grow even greater. Just past the turn in the duct ahead. Should be the four princes directing to the living court. Oh, 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 she ran into the horse lady. Oh, sh... What? Well, then. That's interesting. That's really interesting, actually, yeah. That's scary. That's... Ah! 
Ah, they can do that. They can go through things. Uh-huh. Oh, okay, she's done. Oh, forcibly aborted. Damn. A dolphin by my side says that it was forcibly aborted. Nice. That's... Okay. Very well. Please give the dolphin the release order. Yes. Altogether, it ended up nearly nine hours. There are security measures set up in the ventilation ducts to ensure that no one can pass through them. Must be the nun beast protecting the prince. That's nine hours wasted without any results. I guess even with a restriction like this... Oh, oh. It's collapsing. That doesn't mean the physical burden on my body is going to be any less. If I don't use this ability... With the utmost caution, even the smallest mistake could cost me in my life. A poisonous double-edged sword. Yeah, pretty much. You really screwed. You really screwed yourself over on this one, Kurapika. Yeah! Hell yeah! I was just I was just just a few videos ago. Was it a video? Yeah, two videos ago. No, one video ago. I don't know. Just a while ago I said that yeah, it'd be kinda cool if Kurapika would teach her nan. Um, do you think he can teach Renan as well? You did you did say that knowing it drastically raises your chance of survival, right? Indeed just being able to see what you usually would not be able to able to could completely change your odds. I want to do as much as possible as as possibly as I possibly can for Wobble. Forgive me. You can't, but why? Is it because it will do more harm than good? No, it's not what I meant. I meant forgive me for asking for your approval after the fact. Essentially force it carries a side effect with it. It forces What? That's fucking awesome! Oh shit! He get Oh wow, yeah, that lady, um, that person, one of the um, characters last chapter mentioned that, uh, mentioned that, uh, that, that, um, Kurapika might actually have an ability like that. Huh, since my ability is essentially forced, it carries a side effect with it. It forces awake, latent abilities in non-Nen users, then that means, yes. Your Highness, you are already capable of using Nen. Kurapika. Dude, come on! How much more overpowered are you gonna get, man? Damn, dude. 13th Prince Mariam's bodyguard, Berlin Berlainte. Pro Hunter. 13th Prince Mariam's bodyguard, Berrigan. Queen to oh, a lot of names. Oh my God, there's even more names. Listening, listen in on everything he says, down to the nitty gritty. Find out if he's teaching them correctly and report back to me. Nitty gritty, that was, <laughs> that was pretty cute. <laughs> Learn Nen within the time limit. That's a royal order. She ordered me. Not worried you, but me, I'll say he's just... Oh, okay, I guess they really like her then. <laughs> Eleven friends, if you forget who's me. Why are we here instead of bodyguards? <laughs> Oh, that lady's face on the left panel. That's that's an interesting face, man. She's made lovely civilian. You okay? We got to get away from that room for a few hours. Okay. All right, whatever, guys. What are these? I'm not I'm not sure myself. Oh, this is a different method. I think it probably has to do with that Nen Beast thing that Prince Swabble's bodyguard pro broadcast about. Go on, go and try to find out what this thing is. You have permission to divulge any information we have. I think this was probably done by our Prince's Nen Beast. Oh, oh, cool. Me too. This must be the mark of resolve the Prince was talking about. Okay, maybe. We'll see. Oh, that guy with the intense face. With the intense face. It's another guy with the intense face. Oh, so many intense faces. Truly dangerous, okay. Just have him 
So rather, even if it means bringing the prince along with him. Uh, look, people that actually don't look weird. Wow. And next to him is a really weird looking guy. Okay. What's the other guy's name? Danjin? Okay, yeah. That guy's one of the few characters that doesn't look like an idiot. Mm-hmm. Here we call. Temperaturi. Muha. Danjin. Oh! Oh! Who the hell's that? Oh, it's that guy. I forgot. I already forgot his name. More so than a nan ability, this is a skill game from experience. As it is, in my very lifeline, I never reveal this most secret of my techniques to anyone. The easiest way to differentiate nan users from those that aren't is a shaking around circumference of the eye, visible when looking from the side. Hmm. Obviously, the pro hunters from the association can all use nan, but apart from them. There are four others that are pretending like they can't use it as well. And there, if their reason is the same as the hunters to investigate on the cover, then it poses no problem. However, if they have the same mission as me, then the moment you all activate your police, I will invoke my right to self-defense. Well then. I'm ready whenever you are. Come and get it. Okay. Alright. Oh. He's probably thinking that with a smug look on his face, I can tell even without looking just from that glowing, glowing aura. If that is what he wants, I'm all too happy to oblige. Activate Silent Majority. A wolf among... Okay. He's a conjurer or something. Maybe. We'll see. There's some stuff going on outside. Oh, well, that was a fun chapter. Was There wasn't too much talky-talky like the other ones, but not a lot happened. But Queen Oito can use Nen, and Kurapika is so overpowered. Awesome. Everybody's fainting. Kurapika's dying. Well, I mean, everybody's dying, but, you know, Kurapika is constantly putting his life at risk. Oh, Kurapika, when will you learn? I think now he's finally realized, hey, maybe I should probably not do all that stuff. You know, all those restrictions. Well, anyway, that's been the video. I'm kind of in a rush, so I, I gotta skadoongle. Uh, see him or something. Mm -hmm.